Welcome to the tutorial for the blog content management system. Let's begin by logging on to the administration part of your site. Type in your username and password to sign in. You will see three control panels, blog, photo, and video management. Let's select blog management. You will now be in the control panel of your blog content management system. Clicking on the preview button, allows you to see what the current blog looks like on your site. Here you can see all the different categories and blog posts listed under each category. Let's begin by first creating a new category for our blog. Click on the Add New tab and you'll arrive at a panel where you'll be able to name your category as well as add an icon to represent it in the main list of all categories. Here you will also have to fill out the on-site SEO fields. It is important that you add correct meta title, keywords, and description into your fields. After you've completed that and click Save, you'll be brought back to the Categories page where you'll select the correct category to add your blog post to. Once you've selected and clicked on the category, you'll be on the page where all the blogs of that category are listed. To add a new blog, click Add New. To add a new blog post, first you will need to add information about it, such as title, image, and a short and long description. After writing your blog post title, you will need to select an image. This can be done very easily by clicking Browse. This will allow you to upload an image from your computer, which will then show up in the category where you post your blog article. Continue by writing a short description which will give your readers an idea of what your post is about and then proceed to create a slightly longer description if necessary. Select the date you would like this post to be created and hit Next. Here you will be able to complete your post. Select an image which will be featured in your post by hitting Browse and uploading it from your computer. Afterwards, you will need to write your blog post. Once finished, if you would like to, you may assign your post an authorship then click Next. For search engine optimization purposes, you will need to fill out the meta title, keywords, and description. This will make it easier for the search engines to identify and crawl through your post. Hit Save and you will be taken to the category page which your blog post will be listed under. Here you can mark your post as active where it can be seen or even click on Featured and make it appear as the first one on the list of blog posts in that category. After hitting back, you will be taken to the list of all the categories featured on your blog. If you wish to add, edit, or delete anything, you can do that at any time. Let's click on Stone Massage and see how it's done. Once selected, you can see all the blog posts that are listed under that category name. Let's click on the second blog post and change the title. Click Next and you can change the image that is used in that blog post as well. After hitting Next and then Save, you will be back to the Category menu listing page. Now let's delete a category completely. We can do this by hitting back and exiting to the main list of all the categories. Click on the Delete tab, find the category you wish to delete, click on it, then click Delete again. The category and all the blogs featured under that category will be deleted. Then by clicking Home, we return to our Admin panel. And that brings this blog management system tutorial to a close.